Assalamu alaikum my hair guys in this video I'll be sharing a method using which you can post in all Facebook groups automatically uh, it's actually Facebook auto poster I have like many uh, video on such Facebook auto posting and multi group posters but the thing is it's uh, no more working and if it's working some of the sources I think it's still working uh, but it's hard for user to get uh, use of it like uh, they need uh, token access so mainly use, rarely some user can generate their uh, token and use the poster other than that if you want to generate the post uh, actually the token on their side so you will have to provide your username password and it's like hard for most of the users to provide their credential login detail so that's why i'm skipping those sites like we have vviral and some other poster sites i think so I'll skip those sites and showing you another easy and safe method and it's still working. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, uh, first thing first, you will need this toolkit, whatever you can call it, but it's actually uh, an extension, Chrome extension. I have like plenty of features on it, but this is actually the latest version so far. So to get this toolkit, you need to search for Facebook Auto Reporter. Sorry, not Reporter, actually Social Toolkit is Facebook Social Toolkit, my bad. So this is actually the first link, I'll provide this link in description, but you can search it, it's easy. Uh, it's actually Chrome store link, okay? Click on this. They have changed their name as well. It's now toolkit for FP5 plug EX, whatever. So I already have this one. Uh, as you can see over here, it says remove from Chrome store. But for you guys, it will say add to Chrome. So you need to click on that button. After adding, you will have this icon. You can see over here, TFF, this one. So uh, what you need to do is click on this. It will open another tab. Then there are like plenty of tools, so you have to find this one, uh, which one post on multiple slash all Facebook groups. So this is actually the poster, so you need to click on start tool. So it will bring up this tab, there for it. There we go. Now as you can see over here, it's like the same one, just get rid of this one, there we go. So once you are here, uh, you need to select your groups, if you want to post in all groups, you can select what. Uh, or here select all groups you can click on this actually uh, and if you want to you know customize your posting so you can search search it out by pressing ctrl f and you will have this uh, search box and then you can search for those groups now i want to share a book guidebook regarding youtube so i'll search youtube groups i have like uh, i think it's 12 groups i have so I'll select those groups, let's say this one, I'll search another group, this one, then another one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. Okay, we are done with the selecting. So we have selected 12 groups in this case now the second thing is you need to post your you know provide your status whatever now here's the handy tip for you guys make sure you first check out whatever you want to post let's say if you want uh, to post some you know status whatever you want to post it's safe and you are good to go but if you want to include some links or side links reference or something like that youtube video link make sure you first check it manually on your timeline if it includes nothing harmful or block link then you are good to go with this poster otherwise if you use such links which are already blocked on facebook uh, so it's risky your account will be blocked depending on the limit i think i'm not sure but uh, it's temporary but in some cases uh, you can uh, lose your account so make sure first you check your status whether it's good to go then you can uh, post it here and the third and most important thing is make sure you set the interval time more than 10 seconds or 10 seconds because uh, I, I have experienced this if you uh, select less than like 10 second or 5 second and you want to post it many groups so after some time Facebook will block your action like in posting for for a week so to get rid of this risk make sure you um, set the interval time 10 seconds or more than that so it's actually the wait time between the posting okay now uh, i want to post the link actually it's actually a book 
and by the way if you are interested in youtube secrets uh, it's actually the book uh, by sean cannell it's uh, i'll put out the link in the description it's pretty much handy if you want to buy it uh, and if you want free stuff so i'll also provide the link uh, channel link in the description you can check out it anyway copying this link where it is copy link location and post it here mm, it's empty let me grab some info actually there we go i have like some details over here about this book what it includes and the last thing is if you are interested check out it here already have it over here. there we go now i'm good to go and it's 12 groups so i'm good to go with two seconds but again i'm telling you it's uh, risky if you select two group uh, two seconds for your case uh, if you're a tricky guy or something like that you can handle the risk or you can uh, get uh, your account back so it's up to you i have given you the source the poster so you can use it how you want to use it but if you are a normal user and want to use the facebook auto poster so make sure you follow my instruction first man will check the post whether it's good to go on uh, facebook after that you can post it uh, here in the facebook poster and make sure you uh, use 10 seconds or more than that okay so this is checklist make sure you use this there we go i am good to go and the last thing is click start posting and the best part about this poster is uh, you will have this log once it posts in the group so you can see over here as you can see over here it give me this pop-up post is shared view post and some uh, if somehow you miss this you are working on another side whatever you are doing the poster will do his job and later on you are here so you can check it uh, in the event log let's say I want to check this one so right click uh, and when I want to check out the post whether it's posted in the group or not there we go uh, as you can see over here the post is posted with this link so it's pretty much handy good save Mm, let me check another one for you guys this one also okay there we go another post as you can see over here and when the poster is done with posting it will give you pop up uh, with completion task alert i think so waiting for it i think it's posted on already okay there we go uh, i was talking about this post sharing is completed so you can check out all the logs from here but uh, i have checked it already it's working as you can see over here i have shown you some of the posts but again i am actually highlighting this again and again because some of the views that have, uh, have experienced uh, this block blocking temporary blocking from my previous poster so that's why i'm mentioning this again and again to make sure you uh, first check out your status manually on facebook timeline or in a group if you include nothing uh, harmful or block links so you are good to go with the poster and other than that make sure you use uh, more than 10 seconds depending on your groups how many you know how many groups you want to post in my case it's 12 so i use two seconds and other than that this id is somewhat you can say verified and good to go with the length so i was pretty much sure about my posting that's why i selected two seconds but for your case i am strongly recommending uh, you to select more than 10 seconds or 10 10 seconds or more than 10 seconds okay so that's all for you guys thank you for watching and if you like it make sure hit the like button leave a comment if you want to ask something and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next video with more tricks and tutorials allah is